When we think of birds, we think of the animal as flying and flitting through the air. We often forget there is a flightless variety, like these ones here. All birds are included in this class. Most of them can fly. Their endoskeleton consists of hollow, lightweight but strong bones to facilitate the process of flight. They have an exoskeleton of feathers. These feathers are bad conductors of heat and are extremely light. Their forelimbs are modified as wings which have few flat bones. The endoskeleton consists of spongy bones filled with air. The sternum is large and extends towards the ventral side to form a large boat-shaped keel. Their hind limbs are long and are well adapted to take off during flight and also for walking or running. The hind limbs generally possess three to four clawed toes so that they can have a grip on the branch of a tree and can sit easily. Exoskeleton of horny epidermal scales is seen on these appendages. The jaws are transformed into a horny beak without teeth. The neck is long, adapted for flight and can be moved in all directions. As the muscles are more powerful, they can fly constantly. The digestive tube is well developed which has cloaca at its posterior end. The heart is four-chambered with two auricles and two ventricles. The aortic arch is single and bent towards the right. Nine thin-walled air sacs are attached with the lungs and the trachea. The urinary bladder is absent. The urine is in semi-solid form and is excreted out through the cloaca. The semi-solid urine chiefly has uric acid. They possess 12 pairs of cranial nerves. They are homeothermic or urethermic animals. Due to their high metabolic rate, the body temperature of birds ranges from 40 degrees to 43 degrees Celsius. Female birds have one functional ovary connected to an oviduct. They are oviparous animals which show internal fertilization and external development. The eggs are large, macrolecithal and telolecithal and protected by a strong calcareous shell. They build nests to lay eggs. They exhibit parental care by taking care of their eggs and of the young ones emerging out of the eggshell. Example, pigeon, sparrow, parrot, etc. Some flightless birds like ostrich and emu are also included in this class. All birds are included in the class aves. They have an exoskeleton of feathers. The endoskeleton consists of spongy bones filled with air. Most of them can fly, but some birds are flightless. The jaws of birds are transformed into a horny beak without teeth. The heart is four-chambered with two auricles and two ventricles.